Hutch Cargo and his pals, Spinner and Paddlefoot, in another exciting adventure, The Desert Queen. You remember last time, Clutch and company were traveling by riverboat to the Desert Queen's palace to bring back a 29-pound ruby stolen from the Monrovia National Museum. Clutch, Spinner, and Paddlefoot were leaning on the boat rail when suddenly it gave way. Help! Help! Too bad! Wait for us! They can't hear us! Clutch! Help! That was caught my feet! Hold on, Spinner boy. I'm coming. What the... It's got me, too. It, is it a whirlpool? No, it's a net. We're being pulled toward shore. I wonder who's on the other end of this net. In a moment, we'll know. Halt! Who are you? How'd you get into my net? Take it easy with that gun, mister. Name is Cargo. Clutch Cargo. Clutch Cargo, the famous adventurer author? I don't know how famous, but I'm the one. Clutch Cargo, why, I read your last book. My name's Twaddle, Colonel Lucifer Twaddle. Colonel Twaddle, the foremost authority on prehistoric bones? The same. Well, I read your last book, Colonel Twaddle. Very interesting. Well, that makes it a mutual admiration society. Oh, oh. Paddlefoot liked the part about dinosaur bones. I see. What brings you here? And so, Colonel Twaddle, the ship's rail broke, we fell overboard, and here we are. However, I managed to save this map. It'll show us the overland route to the Desert Queen's stronghold. We're at this point now. First stop, Pharaoh Oasis. Then a short journey by camel to the Desert Queen's palace. Do you prefer your camel with one hump or two? With this gang, we'll need a two-humper. <laughs> That's good. I just happen to have one in the bushes. This is my camel, Sir Duffy. Gee, Paddlefoot, a real camel. And we get to ride him. Already? Clutch, you ride the front hump, Spinner the back hump, Paddlefoot behind Spinner, and I'll ride the middle. <laughs> <laughs> Golly, Clutch, this is like riding on a small-sized roller coaster. Right, Spinner. Just be sure to hang on. I don't know why it is. I always end up with the cheap seats. I'm extremely happy I could join you, Clutch. Perhaps I'll discover some giant brontosaurus bone. Anything is possible where we're going, Colonel. Just be on the lookout for Big Ma. He's dangerous. For miles through hot desert sands they trudge. Tired and thirsty, Clutch and company with Colonel Twaddle arrive upon a welcome scene. Look, Clutch! An Aosis! That's an oasis, Spinner. Anyway, it means water. Don't drink too fast now. Cold water isn't good for you when you're too hot. We'll fill the canteens and be off. He's riding a one-humper. No time to lose. Come on, let's go. He's headed for Sphinxville, too. I hope we can keep Big Ma in sight. I doubt if we can. He's pulling away. Go, Duffy, go! Looks like we've lost him, Clutch. He's gone. Good heavens, Clutch. Look ahead. Sandstorm. Worst thing that could happen. Right in our path, too. I'm traveling this way fast. Cover your noses and mouth. Will Clutch Cargo and company be buried beneath the desert sand? Be sure to tune in for the next exciting episode with Clutch Cargo.